Crypto Bros, welcome back. This video is on 24th June 2024. Finally, after about two weeks without any video, there is a time now that I wanna give you an update because finally there is something going on on the market, right? And it looks like it might be an important time now on the market to consider taking some actions that I'm gonna show you in this video. Before we start, remember, I'm not a financial advisor. This video is only for educational and entertaining purposes. Always do your own research, do your and I have two interesting projects to show you in this video. If you wanna see the video regarding BTC, watch my previous video that I've uploaded. It should be already when you're watching this video. We've offered a little bit, let's start. So what's going on in the market? BTC, as you all know, 61K. Now, it's been very slow. It's been very slow, first of all, for IDO, second of all, for launch bots, third of all, for getting early into pre-sales. Last two months, it was purely player versus players. It was nothing except from me because what was going up. Even projects that were preparing that had crazy tech, right? Crazy development that have been developing the tech for three years since the last bull run. They launched in the current market and they did what? 3X for pre-sale investors with the 10% unlocked tokens. This has been lately the market, right? Now, what's next on the market? How I feel is that, as you can see, altcoins, altcoin season, there is none of it. It's completely BTC season. Nothing is going up, right? At the time when we were already expecting some altcoin season, it never came. Now, crypto fear and greed, finally, right? Small bounce to 61K doesn't change much for for altcoins so how i see it now is that look probably very soon when money will start being implemented into ethereum from ethereum etfs then we might have an interesting rally on altcoins again nobody knows how long it's gonna last nobody knows what this is gonna be about you can speculate what coins those will be nobody knows once again how long this is going to last but once again it looks like the market is money is being manipulated you can see loads of loads of tokens being completely dumped to the prices before the bull run like to the prices of 20k or 15k on btc for example bsw right look at reef right look it's completely down uh bcat ai pad completely down to the prices from the beginning from those prices we are having now those prices from 15k to 20k on btc on altcoins this is this is crazy but this is a reality are you going to adapt to this market or no i'm very interested in kata now i'm getting my position even bigger now i'm accumulating kata especially that katamoto is hitting the only narrative that has been performing well for lately which are meme coins right only meme coins in the current market have been performing well look last seven days that's 24 hours this is crazy this is completely degen and like it or no but this is the market now right and katamoto is a launch pad for those meme coins and it's still a very small cap for this reason i'm accumulating more for this reason i'm, I'm getting more more of these tokens especially that it was launched on tencel on ape terminal big launch pads so that's the thing a lot of questions might appear like are altcoins finally going up to the prices to the normal price like look, look at dao maker all right 50 cents look at uh i don't know zen look at even Weltcoin. even Weltcoin guys project from OpenAI is almost back to the prices from the bear market if you're asking me am i buying those coins no i'm only buying coins that i believe are hitting the narrative i think Weltcoin might might hit the narrative i don't think the the ai is over but look at pepe pepe is doing well pepe is doing extremely well once again this is the market like it or no and i want to show you one more project that is fitting the ai narrative and this is i own it you might hear about it they recently launched or well, two weeks ago on binance it might be actually the latest project launching on binance the market cap is 300 mil still small market cap but the fully diluted market cap is 2.7 billion dollars all time high from coin market cap might be might be different but from coin market cap is around six dollars 6.3 dollars it was what around 600 mil market cap and i own it has something that all ai startups need which is gpus so i own that is decentralized gpu cloud in the simplest possible way basically a, a gpu's network so they are hitting the ai compute market 
I would think of it that all the startups will need it. All the AI startups will need it because they need millions of different data to be utilized into their DAP, into their product, whatever it is, into their language model, AI language model. There are huge amounts of data that they, that they need to implement. And for this reason, they need GPUs. Now, if you have GPUs, you can use IONET Marketplace, which is fully decentralized. And thanks to that, those who want to use it, and we are talking about now about, for example, startups, because they have to use it, they have to use it, they have it cheaper, faster, and it's on blockchain, right? Fully decentralized. So could it be better? Now it looks like it's a smart move from, from Binance as well, because it's like selling shelters in the gold rush. So instead of mining gold, you're selling shelters. Think of it like that, right? Look, 100x more GPUs than major competitors. Their token is on Solana. It's our official partner at Aptos. Look, accelerate your earnings by providing GPUs. And also before they were doing an airdrop for people who were putting their GPUs to work. They were motivating people to put their GPUs to work in exchange for, for the airdrop and people made a lot of money on the airdrop as well. That's an interesting concept, look, 200, 260 USD per month and earn etc etc daily. Interesting new ways of making money. It's a huge topic if you're not familiar with it. So they are aiming to create the largest GPUs network in the world. So they are aggregating the GPUs from what I know from gaming, from crypto miners, from data centers, etc. They have those three products for now, which is the, the cloud and worker and explorer. If you're more interested into that, I'm gonna leave you a link in the description. You can check this out on your own. I'm not gonna log in now because we don't have time for it in this video, maybe in the next one. Look, AI gaming deep in because IONET is deep in as well, decentralized physical infrastructure. And there is a good thread about it, as you can see. You can stop the video now and, and there is a, a nice comparison of the decentralized GPU projects. So there's around 150,000 verified GPUs chips and around 43,000 CPUs. I'm not gonna explain about CPUs, that's, that's a bit different topic because fully they learn market cap is 2.7 billion. Of course, they raised a lot of money in the seed phase of the token sale around 40 million in, in the seed phase. They have huge names, huge VCs invested in, um, Animoca brands, etc., etc. I'm not gonna put all names here. So I'm gonna leave you with that. Check the project, it's an interesting one. And still, looks like the narrative might continue and might continue going up. Coming back to the market, remember, it's the same that I, what I told you in the previous video also regarding altcoins and BTC. If you're not sure, if you're unsure about what's the what's going on on the market, if you're not feeling the market because the volumes are lower, remember that staying out of position is also a position and just waiting is also a position, all right? If you're not that much into DJing, into being player versus player on meme coins, there is not much else to be made now on the market when all the altcoins, well, most of the altcoins are basically down to the ideal prices. So thank you so much for watching. Catch you in the next one and bye-bye.